Jam back again. Another video. Jim Jam reacts to the paranormal. This one uh, my wife sent me. Uh, it's a uh, 12 creepiest doorbell camera clips. So this is like from uh, like a rain camera, you know, doorbell camera or something like that. Uh, I guess uh, we should get into this. Check it out. This video was captured by a Reddit user's doorbell camera. He claims to have woken up to his dog going crazy outside, followed by a notification from the app Ring, saying motion was detected at his door. Upon opening the app, we he greeted to nothing but an eyeball mine. looking directly into his camera, and a man whispering and mumbling to himself. He proceeds to knock and ring the doorbell, he then begins trying his luck at the doorknob and window, all the while still mumbling and whispering to himself. After the homeowner threatens to call the police, the man gets defensive and claims he was just looking for his dog, conveniently named Fido. Okay, I, I was just looking for my dog, Fido. Like that and stuff, honey. You know, we could be friends. <laughs> could be friends. So, uh, what would y'all do if, uh, you know, if you, most people, well, not most, but a lot of people have that ring or a doorbell camera. What would you do if you get a notification on your phone and you see something like that? Uh, I haven't experienced nothing. Well, my daughter said that she thinks that she saw something. Well, she showed me a picture. It looked like a little cat or something, the bottom right corner. Oh, if I had the picture, I'd show you. I don't know if I have any more, but, uh, um, yeah, I would probably freak out if uh, I got a notification. I looked on it and I see that. Here we go, number 11. In this video, we see a man seemingly waiting to be led into a house. Whether it's his house or not is unknown. As he waits by the door, a strange animal-like transparent figure can be seen floating towards the door, and as it reaches and passes the man, he turns, possibly reacting to a sound he may have heard. That was pretty wild. Look right there. Creepy. These are two clips that were likely taken back during the entire clown epidemic of 2016. In this first clip, we see someone dressed. Yeah, I remember that when there wasn't uh, rioting happening and uh, the COVID-19 and all that. You had uh, clowns, clown invasion of 2016. Is that what you said? Yeah. Just as a clown welding a small sword, lurking around by the front door for a bit and running off after ringing the doorbell. Similarly, in this next clip, someone dressed as a clown can be seen standing in the distance, looking at the front door. Oh, sir, sir. After a while, he approaches the door, seems to stare into the doorbell camera for a few seconds, and walks away. Whether these were pranks meant to scare the homeowners or not, most people wouldn't want to open their doors to these two. Nope. Look at that. Just chilling right there. Let's go back real quick and. Similarly, in this next see? clip, someone dressed standing. as a clown can be seen standing in the well, I would crap myself. I saw that on my... In 
this video, around 2 p.m., the man in the dark hoodie seen here apparently rang the doorbell and no one answered. The man who lives in this house was wearing headphones, therefore couldn't hear the doorbell. So the man in the hoodie likely presumed no one was home and soon returned with his friend in the white hoodie around 15 minutes later. The man in the dark hoodie attempts to kick in the door while his friend in the white hoodie stands by. The man who owns the house is able to hear the loud bangs of the attempted burglar's foot hitting the door and he yells out something unintelligible that scares the two men off. Dude had a serious door, man. That door didn't give. <laughs> In this video, the camera catches a shirtless man approaching the door. But instead of actually ringing the bell or knocking on the door, he pretends to knock on the door. What you can't see on the screen is a car that's waiting for the man in front of the house. According to the homeowner, he could be seen talking to someone waiting in the car off camera later on. It's likely that the shirtless man was forced to do something by the person in the car, clearly something that he doesn't want to do given that he fakes an entire conversation with the homeowner, all the while checking to make sure the person in the car could see him talking. It was apparent he or the person in the car were looking for a person named Matt, who they thought lived in this house. One could only imagine what this man was put out to do to this mad person. Say that stuff happens a lot. In this video, the doorbell camera detects motion, Ooh, but seemingly nothing appears in the frame except for a small white orb that floats across the screen. Some and stuff I usually tell you know you see right here uh, the the light on the uh, the light <laughs> uh, but that was floating across and nothing was moving so that was definitely eerie that could be paranormal investigators have referred to orbs appearing in pictures and videos from allegedly paranormal sources Usually, Apparently the orb in this moving. video was significant no, no, enough to trip the so motion sensors of the camera system. I think it's definitely an orb. I need to start watching my camera see if I can see anything, but I see a lot of bugs. This one isn't a video, but rather a pretty disturbing picture caught by a Redditor's doorbell camera. After being woken up by a notification on their phone, they checked it to see a message saying, Your doorbell detected a visitor. After checking the app, they didn't see anything and as anyone would, assumed it was maybe a bug or a small animal that tripped the motion sensor. However, the Redditor received more notifications, and after checking the app again, was faced with this disturbing image. Whether it's even a male or female is almost impossible to tell, but perhaps the most be crazy. disturbing part of the image is the shape and distance of the person's eyes. It's not something anyone would ever want to see at their front door. In this video, we see someone wearing a mask approaching the door and covering the doorbell with a piece of tape. The homeowner got an alert that motion was detected on the porch, and upon checking the footage was ready to grab his gun. It's not known what was done while the tape was covering the camera, but eventually one side of the tape peeled off, revealing the person in the mask was gone. The homeowner doesn't know if it was simply kids playing a prank or someone who meant him and his family harm. Getting my gun, I know that. This video shows exactly why you should always check who's outside your door before opening it. Man, he's carrying a gun like it ain't nothing. On the doorbell. This doorbell camera caught two men in front of the house. One of them approaching the front door and ringing the doorbell, armed with a gun. He attempts to hide his face as he approaches the door, then hides off to the side, waiting for someone to open up. The other man walks down the sidewalk, waiting for his friend to do whatever he was about to do. But luckily, nobody answered the door. Oh. Right. This homeowner's camera captured two suspicious men pull up in their driveway and wait outside their front door. The one on the left quickly notices the camera and the two flee.
That didn't look suspicious at all. <laughs> but not even 15 minutes later, the two pull up into the homeowner's driveway again, having apparently decided they'd go through with the break-in anyway. This time, one of them immediately attempts to kick the door down, but the homeowner is ready this time and speaks through the doorbell speaker, claiming the police are on their way, scaring the two off for good this time. Like On September 10th, 2018, a Florida man wearing a bulletproof vest and carrying an assault rifle rang his neighbor's doorbell at 4 in the morning. Well, he drunk. The yeah, homeowner grabbed her two place. children and stayed put in the bathroom. Yeah. After spotting the man on her security footage, she immediately called the police and her husband, who was out of town for work. Roughly 25 minutes later, the police arrived. The man faced aggravated assault charges. The homeowner said the daughter of the unnamed man had stayed at their home recently, claiming she was afraid of her own father. Wow. Well, drunk as hell. <laughs> at some off hour in the night, this man's doorbell camera captures a mysterious, transparent looking blurry figure slowly moving down the sidewalk across the street. There. See it? scared to look at my own ring camera. Right there, it's it closely from. resembles a human, and that's what most may assume. But the weird part of this one was that after reviewing the footage, the homeowner asked a neighbor who also had a camera to check their footage at the same time. And their footage didn't reveal the figure walking down the sidewalk. Oh. See a car under that car stop. Wow, that's that's pretty wild right there. Um, hey, let me know if you got a ring camera and if you caught anything uh, on it. Uh, like I said, uh, my daughter caught a little cat or something. Well, I ain't seen nothing wild or crazy, but uh, if you have any kind of ring or any kind of paranormal activity, let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching. Uh, like, share, subscribe. Um, Hit them. Uh, hit the link in the, for the merch. Got some merch. New haunt order. Uh, shirt. I'm rocking. Um, check it out. Thanks for watching. Peace. Mm -hmm.